Hey guys, Goldbear back here today with another review. And today, guys, we are going to be opening the final Five Nights at Freddy's Curse of Dreadbear action figure, and that is Captain Foxy. It's surprising. I went to Walmart today and I had never even thought that I was going to see this guy on the shelf, but I walked through the aisle and there he was. And actually, there was a few of them. Now, obviously, I wasn't going to buy all of them, but you know. We got him now in the collection, and I can't wait to open him and show you guys. Uh, so, yeah, Walmart exclusive, so you can only find him at Walmart, or you can find him on the internet, maybe Amazon. So, you can find him on Amazon. I have checked. You can get him on Macari, but, you know, if you really want to pay $200 for an action figure, which I doubt you do. But, uh, yeah, anyways, look at the back of the box. Uh, Something that I noticed that's kind of weird is he's not even on the box. He, they don't show him whatsoever. So I guess they just aren't showing the exclusives or something. But oh well. Obviously you got Dreadbear, Jackal Bonnie, Glitch Trap, and Grim Foxy. We already reviewed all those characters on the channel. So won't have to worry about those for a while. Um, I am going to be making a group video of all of them. And that should come out uh, Sunday for halloween so yeah enough jibber jabber let's get this guy out of the box i'm being a little quiet tonight because parents are trying to sleep so i hope you guys can understand and if you guys can't hear me i'm sorry i'm gonna try to get this guy out of the box as careful as i can so i don't rip it because as you guys know i like to keep my packages a little mid condition so I got, I got something new here it's kind of like a kind of goes halfway through and then like a little crease there which isn't really a big difference at all but oh well <laughs> take it off camera here and in the meantime you can look at my original foxy which we will be doing a comparison with so stay tuned <laughs> i guess the one thing i really noticed about these figures is they really don't make it easy to take out of the box as for this one, I'm afraid we might have to tear the box. I don't want to do that, but we might. <laughs> yeah, they got this one in here good. Of course. Oh, here it comes. So didn't really ruin the package at all but here is captain foxy out of the box we'll get him out of there in a second here just gonna well i'll just throw that to the side for now let's cut him out of here and take a look at him because you know i've been just like really wanting this figure for a long time and now i finally got him in the collection thank god and oh yeah another thing you guys didn't know i got a job <laughs> so updates about that coming out soon uh, about my job uh, i just want to tell you guys that videos are going to be kind of slow but i promise you guys i promise you guys gold bear isn't going anywhere he's just going to be taking a break from the internet kind of so let's see, pop that back in here. And you know, there you go, Captain Foxy. Um, right off the bat, I'm gonna give the figure 10 out of 10. He's spot on. The color on like the body, it's all brand new color. Uh, it's a lighter red than the old Foxy. My Foxy's kind of broken, so I'm gonna be a little, I'm gonna try to be a little gentle with him. Let's see if I can, okay, that works. Yeah, the arm is really loose, so we're not going to be bending that too much. The joint, something I noticed in the past with Funko is the joints tend to get really loose. And 
you know, I really don't know why. <laughs> and they break. And it's kind of it kind of sucks, but to be honest, this figure, 10 out of 10 again, um, you know, arms move. I think his hand. Oh. Let me look at the. I would say his hand does move, but guys, I wouldn't recommend it. If you have this figure and you've already, and it's better than mine, then that's a good thing. But the hand on mine, you know, they've been using this new type of plastic that's more rubbery. So it's kind of, it could probably bend a little bit harder or, well, it can bend pretty easy now. And I wouldn't do it because it could damage the figure. Um kind of the the cape here you know it's made out of a pretty thick plastic so i mean you can bend it but it's not like the the rick and morty figure that came out a while ago the rick one where you could think that you can literally take the entire vest off of him this is kind of different uh the pirate hat is pretty good i do like that about him but yeah you know there's not really a lot of differences about this except he's wearing it's just like FNAF 1 Foxy but with a pirate uh, jacket on and a hat. Uh, something I didn't know is the eye patch is a little different. You can see that he's got that crease in his eye patch and this eye patch is just a regular round eye patch. There's no creases or anything. But the, I, I'd say the only difference between the two is the color. But either way, they're the same pretty much the same figure but i'm still happy to have uh captain foxy in the collection he's a really good addition for it and i hope to get that uh group video for you guys soon so if you guys like the video leave a like comment down below what you liked about the video or comment anything really as long as it's not inappropriate and subscribe for more and i will see you in the next video peace